Hey there, this is Colton at North Island Nissan. I wanted to make you a quick walk around video on the 2009 Jeep Wrangler that we had. I haven't heard from you uh, since you inquired on it. So I figured just in case maybe you're out of town, uh, whether you live somewhere else or maybe you're working at camp or something like that, I figured this could be a better way to give you a good look at the vehicle, uh, a little bit better than pictures or something like that. Now, if there's anything specific on this Jeep that you do want to see, just let me know. I'll be happy to make another video or snap a few pictures or whatever you like best, but I'll do an overall walk around right now the biggest point of damage on this vehicle is a bit of a crack in the the front here i think that's probably the worst thing on it though so it's pretty darn great considering it is a 2009 it's in good shape uh, i'll sh show you the interior here real quick and i will hop around the driver's side to show you some of the features as well but everything's nice and clean in it it's in good shape we have had a few rainy days here and uh, especially with the jeeps one of the concerns with them is leaking and i have not yet noticed any leaking in this jeep which is very nice and kind of surprising almost with the jeep um that being said uh, it is certainly possible that there is leaking somewhere in it as jeeps are very well known for that but as far as i've seen this one is so far leak free which is great to see show you the back here lots of space in the back seats uh, those front seats do fold down as well and yeah everything's nice and dry back here no leaking along the sides very nice to see that with jeeps and yeah there are a few scrapes and things around here but we're looking at a uh, what is this nine-year-old vehicle now so it's in great condition considering Got the running boards along the side to hop in nice and easy. There is the power locks, the switch for that, and power mirrors as well. It is a manual seat with this model, and it is an automatic as well. Uh, hopefully you saw that online there. I'll show you the key real quick. It is a key fob, so you got the power locks and the panic button on the key. And I'll just start the vehicle up real quick. Straighten this out for us. All right, so we're at 128, 117 kilometers. You get a little uh, compass as well as the outside temperature uh, up front there as well, which is nice. Uh, you do get cruise control on the steering wheel. And then you got that nice classic Jeep steering wheel on it as well. Uh, and then we have the radio controls over in the center. So pretty straightforward there. You got your volume on the left and tuning knob on the right. All of your different uh, modes up top, or your sources rather, for the auxiliary uh, CD player, AM and FM radio. And then your presets are along the bottom there. Uh, below that, these are actually the uh, window controls here. So you get all four of the windows. And then this is the window lock there temperature controls are right below that you got your modes on the left fan strength in the middle and then your temperature on the right hand side uh, air conditioning buttons right there for that and then you got your hazard lights and, uh, and then your gear shifter down below you also have your 4x4 lock there as well so you can lock it into 4 high or low and then you got your e-brake here so yeah, it's a very nice vehicle. It's nice and clean. It is a removable uh, top as well if, uh, for the summertime when we finally start to get a little bit war warmer weather. It's pretty darn cold out today. Um, but like I said at the beginning, if there's anything on this vehicle that you do want to see specifically, just let me know. I'll be happy to put another video together for you. But I hope you're enjoying April so far. I hope you enjoyed this video and have a great rest of your day. Goodbye.